What's up, guys? So I got a question about how to do a takedown from the knees. One of the guys sent me an email says that he's at a gym where they don't do a lot of takedowns. They have to start down on the ground a lot because of space, and so they're not able to do much rolling from the feet. I really don't like the idea of like showing a takedown from the knees, but I'll give you something. So first off, like, again, I, I kind of hate this because again, you know, if you're gonna do a takedown, you need to do it from the feet. But if you can't really get the guy down, don't end up just doing this, like locking up here and then like muscling each other around. Because this is this is pointless, right? This is useless. I'm not getting anything out of that. I'm muscling around a person in a really like in a position that's never gonna happen. You're not gonna be wrestling around on the knees in a fight or in a competition or anything. So if for some reason you can't get the person down, let's just pull guard. At least now we're doing jujitsu. If you don't feel comfortable on your back, even more so, pull guard so that you get better at that position. Now I will show you something that at least has some sort of transferable benefit to other positions. And this is basically, we'll show from this side first, just gonna be an over under. So if you're here, like if you're up on the knees and you're locked up with the person, we wanna click quickly, like get an inside tie. We're gonna trap the tricep, come under with the underhook here, and at the same time pop and come down chest to chest. And the reason that this might be useful for other positions is if let's say Brian shoots a double, boom, if I can get a hold of here, I can use it in that position where I can get an underhook and quickly turn my torso. So the key to doing this is, is a very quick snap. So instead of just coming in here, getting the underhook, and now trying to muscle where he's a little bit more conscious of the fact that I have an underhook and an overhook, is just be here with like a tight, right? And in one motion, go under over, boom. This way. So get inside here, guys. One motion. Go from this inside tie grip to over under. Turn it off to the side. And we'll turn this way. And we can go to side control. But again, ultimately, if you're going to do a takedown, you need to be on your feet doing it. You need to practice them, whether it be for like self defense situation or just competition. But if you are going to do a takedown for the knees, that might be an option. If that fails, or any option that you have doing a takedown on the, on the knees, if that fails, just be smart. Let's play some jiu-jitsu, pull guard of some sort, and start rolling. That's it.